Why did I sign up for this? Why did I do this to myself? It is Indy at Daytona. I believe old Bumpy Daytona at that. Um, is it? I'm not sure, actually. Well, it feels kind of bumpy. Anyway, why did I do this to myself? The world may never know. You got about five but of fuel left. Push, 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 push. This oh, is a bit of a meme race. <laughs> Uh, they would never, in modern times, bring these Indy cars here. Um, there would be multiple casualties. And there would be a lot of answering to do. From, uh, whoever decided to put it on the schedule. So, I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory, I think, right? You're in an Indy car, going 200 and... 35 plus miles an hour okay, here comes your first time with black. Green, green, green. plenty other people around you getting massive runs from the draft although not, a, not, not quite as massive as you might think but still um, potentially coming up on people um, You've got about two laps I think fuel. you could probably see where, where this would go wrong. <laughs> uh, I also believe this might be single split. I don't think too many people have signed up. One more lap. I just I clicked that little green button on the website, because I don't use the UI, I use the website. That, uh, you know, to go race. I don't know why I did it. I really don't. I saw it and I'm like... I feel like racing right now. But that's not a good explanation for why I clicked on it. <laughs> this, it, there's almost no way this ends well. No way at all. Um, I don't even know why I'm qualified. I mean, I, I guess, you know, I'm the number two, so... If I don't qualify... Oops. If I don't qualify, I'm just going to end up at the end of the number of people that did qualify. And if I do qualify, maybe I can get up a little higher in front of maybe where the mess will happen? I don't know. I, like, I can't explain anything that's happening. Uh, so you know what? I'm just going to... I'm just gonna go for it, man. I'm just gonna be here. I'm gonna hold my line. I'm gonna look around me, stay focused, and probably end up flying through the air into the catch fence and being diced up into 300,000 different little pieces. But you know what? Watch your speed limit in the pits. We'll be going fast before that. We're going to be going real fast. So at least there's that. The car has run out of fuel because they only put in enough fuel to do the qualifying laps in Indy. They do that automatically for you. It's nice of them to do. Don't know where they're getting 37.4. Okay, Colton. There's a lot of things I don't know about or understand about IndyCar. Which is just, you know, just makes this so much better. But we're here. Boy, are we here. We've even got some great pings to look forward to. And one guy already disconnected. Um, but we got Australia, Asia, Japan, Italy, Iberia, New Jersey. We got them all from all over the world here. And when you're going 235 plus miles an hour around the corner, inches from each other, and the internet's just doing its best to predict where you are, sometimes it gets it a little wrong. Bad things can happen. But I knew that already, signing up. I knew bad things are going to happen. That's the end I still clicked that little green button, so here we go. We're, we're headed into the race. 
Ah, <sighs> Godspeed. We're just gonna put up the all-time best lap and, you know, enjoy the absurd miles per hour we're reaching, I guess. That's pretty much all I have to say about it, to be truthful. We don't have that data. Theoretically, we might have to do green flag pit stops. It could happen. I mean, realistically, you could get a early crash early on that takes out just about every car, and then suddenly there's not very many cars left to wreck for the rest of the race, and all of a sudden you're doing a green flag pit stop because everyone's separated. I don't know. I've seen a couple of races here um, by other people. And uh, they do. They have gone green a little bit. I don't know about this potential like single split situation we have going on here. And we're sandwiched right in between the two lowest strength uh, people. It doesn't necessarily mean they're the worst. I mean, clearly they can qualify very well. But, you know, they could be less experienced. Um, who knows? Maybe it's a good thing. You don't really know until you get out there. It's not a good thing is that I'm the number two in a low strength of field. And whenever I inevitably become a meat cube after this, uh, my I rating is going to be divided by zero as well. And it's gonna explode, and uh, they'll probably just ban my account. So, and have a good run. hey, I'll see you later. Fifty laps. The air temp is. I'm just gonna try not to be the one that causes the wreck. I think that's pretty reasonable. Follow car number. I think I might actually uh, tighten it up a little bit. I don't know. That's One probably a bad degree. idea. We'll find You're out. on the outside this time. Pit road is closed. Outside, second row. We're warming the tires up. Oh, they look like they're on a team. Got the same uh, liveries. That's how you say it, livery. So they must be on a team or something. Know each other. Yeah, what did you got over there? Yellow and green, so they got something else. I've got like my chewing gum <laughs> car. It's, I think it's winter fresh. So I have nice breath. <laughs> so we're breathing down each other's necks uh, in this race. So. Yeah, looks like a first gear start. Looks like uh, our internet is doing fine, so. That's good. We don't have to worry about our own. I doubt tires are going to be a thing. But, you know. Will guys be patient? Or are we going to be three wide in the turn one? I don't know. You never know. 50 whole laps, though. A long way. Long way to go. Even if, uh. Going green. Even at, uh. Daytona, the laps are going to be fairly quick. It tends to happen when you're going so fast, so. Alright. I'll miss you guys. Green flag, green flag. Not going, I guess. Car inside. Strange. Stay high, there's a car on the low side. Still there, hold your line. A little extra room in case they got Clear some inside. ping issues. Inside. Still there, inside. Stay high. Clear inside. Inside. Still there. I'm trying to go anywhere right now. Just trying to be, high. uh, trying to survive. Clear inside. Inside. Stay high. Shift. Still there, hold your line. Still there, inside. I'm just got taken three wide, I think. Appreciate them for thinking. Stay high, the for second side. guessing that one. I'm okay with just staying up here. 
Keep high. Clear. Inside. Still inside. Keep high. You're never gonna pull away from anyone, obviously. So you just be away like this. You're in clear. Still there. So, uh, hold line. Just gonna hold our spot. Hope no one takes us three wide. Be patient, lock some laps. Clear inside, car inside. Maybe die a little bit, who knows. Not really up to me. I mean, it could be up to me, I could just dart left or something. Not gonna do that though. Just gonna focus on controlling this thing, because, you know. Not always too familiar with how a, an indie car feels. I turned my force speed back down quite a bit too, because it was doing lots of bumping. And you don't necessarily need all that much at a super speedway usually, so. Keep high. Clear. Car inside. We uh, sure are going fast. Still inside. Still inside. I'm afraid to look anywhere other than in front of me though. It's like we're going faster every lap, too. I mean, if you look at the uh, whole time best, that's pretty wild. Keep high, clear inside. About 240 in the corners, looks like. Still there. Stay high with the car on the low side. I'm doing a lot of lifting, too. Still inside. Stay high. Yeah, put that uh, weight jacker to the tighter side, because I just didn't want it to snap on me. I'd like to go ahead and put it back now. Okay. Clear. Inside. I wonder if these guys on the team will have just the plan to, uh, they just plan on blocking the two front rows the whole time. Still there, inside. Still there. I feel okay. I'm super nervous. Still there, hold your line. Like I said, I don't want to be the one that makes the mistake. So I'm super nervous, but um Still seems inside. to be well within control. Clear. It just does feel a little strange because like I said I turned the force feed back down a little bit. Keep high. And uh, these things are always on edge, so. Still there at the bottom. Are we really going faster every Still lap? Is that is that right? Clear. I guess it has to be because you know you're burning up fuel, and the, the weight of the fuel matters in these cars quite Still a bit. Inside. Wow. Keep high. Still there, so I better relax my hands at least a little bit, because we got a long way to go. I don't need my hands cramping by lap 30. Still there. Just a look. Keep They've not wrecked back there either. You know, no one's wrecked. Assume, I assume. Must have caution to come out, unless they, you know, ended up on the apron or something. Uh, it looks like someone's on the wall behind me. Like in that. You're back in fourth position. Still there, hold your line. <sighs> Keep high. Heart's pounding. The stakes are just so high. I mean, you can go around a tiny track like Milwaukee Mile or something in these things, and if you tap the wall, you can just, you know, your car's broken. How about going 250, tapping the wall? I'm sure, uh, I'm sure it'll be fine. You know, it's just uh, a matter of time, though. You know, a guy, uh, someone's internet. 
there. makes a mistake, thinks that uh, they're heading up higher on the track than they are. It's all it takes. And the guys get a little bit too close, and it says, that's close enough. It's like uh, cutting the wire to defuse the bomb. I cut the wrong one. I think I've used that analogy before, but boy, does it feel true at a time like this. I don't know if I mentioned, it is fixed series. So it's not like these guys up front have like their uh, their team set up or something where that's why they were able to qualify up there. Probably just good. I don't know what they're And know how to find speed even on a track that's flat out, pretty much. Keep high. You're in the middle. I've just been taking three wide, so I'll miss you guys. Why you would do that on what is it, lap ten? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if the thought process there. You sure did it though. You sure did it. I guess they're not. Uh, they're not scared. They're not tense. They're like, you know what? I'm gonna go for the lead right now. What do you gain from it? I don't know. I'm just gonna be right there with you. Not getting away. Someone almost hit me on the inside. It's a scary sound when you hear their, uh, someone else's engine getting louder in your ear. So, uh, I've got more uh, people in front of me that are a potential wreck. Like, uh, three wide McGee. So, you know, that's what I kind of wanted to avoid being up front, but um, I'm not going to fight three wide for an extended period of time. I'm going to put an end to that as soon as I can. I kind of like to bail out, but I'm kind of trapped. No way for me to really get out of here. As much as I would like to escape, there is no escape in Indy Fixed at Daytona. You're all along for the ride once you sign up for this very, very fast ride. I'm um, just kind of hoping I don't get taken three wide again. That wasn't very fun. Um, but you see how far they got doing that. Was it worth the risk? Maybe. Maybe they care about the track position that much. I don't think so. I don't agree with that. I'm not so sure I care that much about that track position. But they felt it was uh, something they needed to do, and they went and did it. You know what? We didn't hit each other. So, yeah, you know, they did it. They were just fine. Scared me a little, but they were just fine. Guy high. Hear uh, that engine loud in my left ear. Always a little discomforting. Just constant engines from every direction. That's what boxed in. Mm, I saw a tire. That's how close they got. 21. Lowest, uh, lowest rank guy. But they've uh, kept it clean so far. Giving them as much room as I feel I can. So I get into the wall or something myself. Picking up a bit. Okay. Still there at the bottom. breathe. That guy almost hit me. I'd like to get out of here. I really, really would. 
they don't look like they're able to turn into the corner all that well. Uh, that's not good for me, considering I'm the one that is on the outside of the side corner. Still there. Still there. But again, there's no escape. There is no escape. Still there, inside. Clear inside. Still there at the bottom. Clear mm. inside. Didn't like that. Check the car inside. You're up top, three wide. I'm up top, three wide. Right Two wide. Still there. Yeah. Still there. Not a fan. <laughs> Why did I sign up? Why did I do this to myself? Why did I sign up for this? <laughs> Why did I do this to myself? <sighs> do you like some free anxiety? We got the thing just for you. It's Indy fixed a Daytona. Want to cut hours, maybe even days off your life? Run this a couple times. Still there, hold your line. Clear inside. Car inside. I'm still alive though. Almost ha Almost jinxed it. Oh, I still might be jinxing it. Uh, they're getting weirdly close. Okay. Um, we're almost halfway. But we might not make it halfway because they're starting to do some weird things. I'm not taking anyone three wide. I absolutely refuse. There's no need for it at this point. Clear, car oh, they are really loud. In Still my left inside. ear. Still there. Still there inside. Pinching each other a little bit, Clear looks inside. like. Car inside. Person Still got there. really close to me. Still there. Still would like to fall back, but that's not really an option. I feel like I can successfully fall back somewhat. There it is. Okay. I don't know what it was, but keep it green. There it was. <sighs> okay. Well, no caution. Guy got in the wall. No caution. We got some guys pitting around halfway. The next car's the leader. Okay. The yellow flag is out. Man, the yellow flag is out. Single file. Pit road is closed. Catch up, hey. How about that? You've got about five laps. We're still alive. Like and and we uh, we don't have to do a green flag pit stop. Catch car. 14.8 gallons. Pace car is out. Line up single file. Catch car. Eight car. Pace car is out. Pits are closed. Can you just hit twice? No. No, of course not. What am I talking about? Left up three. Carbide. You had the position when the yellow flag came out. Your engine temperatures are okay. All clear on engine temperatures. Coming up on halfway here. 
Alright, I believe I will be sitting in the pits, hanging back. Did not quite like being up there so much, and it's only going to get more intense as this thing gets further along. So, I'm going to... Hi. I am going to bank on the fact that they will wreck once more. At the minimum. Still, uh, we'll probably try to keep the draft a bit, but... We'll fill it full of fuel, we'll put tires on it, because why not? Alright. Make your phone, guys. Please, please, quick, quick. Reduce the gap. Okay. I checked up for that guy on the wall, and there was someone behind me. It almost ran into me. It's very close. Box in, five, four, three, two, one, box now. By the way, I, um, <clears throat> I, uh, learned a thing, so I usually keep my pit objects, uh, detail to low, because, uh, that hides other people's pit boxes and makes it easier for me to see, but I learned through watching one of, uh, Nick's videos, uh, Nibin, uh, that you can actually keep your quality high, but set the pit objects total to uh, one, and it'll only show yours. So I can I can actually get to see like my pit crew hanging out and stuff, and uh, and uh, still be able to find my box. So that's really cool. You got plenty of fuel. Plenty of fuel. Okay, so we're good on fuel. We got the new tags. What were they? 9791. Interesting. They did wear a little bit, particularly on the right rear. Still don't know much about uh, Indy car and how tire saving works or anything like that. Or how they tend to wear. So, it's always interesting to me, for me to look at. Go ahead and catch the field. I almost rear-ended a guy. Saw some tire smoke. I enjoy it back here. I think I will feel much more comfortable One to go. Nick back Tom here. Race the regime at the end of this lap. I believe lap cars will maintain their positions at this point in the race in the uh, Indy in the Indy car. So 18 should probably just they'll probably just be staying there. I think, right? I don't pass them or anything. Yes, looks that way. So, that's a little bit uh, something different from some of the other series I do. Lap cars mixed in there. I wonder what happened. I wonder if they got trapped a lap down because of uh, when they chose to pit or something. Because uh, they don't look like they got damage or anything that they had to fix. But I don't have a very trained eye, so I can't really see the front very much anyway. So. And usually I figure if you're going to wreck here, you're done. You're done. You're not uh, getting that thing fixed. Hopefully they don't hang all this far back whenever it's actually time to start racing again. Because then we're just going to be, we're going to lose the draft. And then that's that. I do want to be a little bit of, I want to be like, at least able to catch back up to the draft if it goes green to the end. And uh, if they're already out of the draft before we even get green, then... Well, that's a bit of a problem. Just look how much space they're leaving between everyone. That's curious. You know it's one to green, guys. Get ready, you know we gotta go. Green. It literally says get ready going green. Why are we all the way back here? I mean, I know we're trying to avoid the wreck, but can we at least stay in the draft? Anybody? Going green, 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 then. 
I don't know why we're so far back. Car inside, clear. Inside. Stay high, there's a car on the low side. Caution, caution. yellow flag. Oh, Line up caution, I don't five. see it. Pit road is closed right now, past bus 15. I don't see where the caution was. <laughs> Interesting. But, uh... Now we're gonna have to wait for another caution session. At least we got in front of some of the people who just have decided not to go. Interesting. Wonder what that was. There's someone in the back. Oh, the 21. Wait. Yeah, the 21. Look at that. They, they left. They were in sixth. I guess something happened way up front. Yeah, I missed it. I remember seeing them, though. We, uh... Base car is ten seconds behind us, guys. We, we can go catch it now. I have to assume these guys are probably new or something. That's why they don't know what we're supposed to be doing right now. Pit road is now open. I guess it doesn't matter too much in the grand scheme of things, because I'm not trying to pit or anything, but, like... We've got a long way to go. It's a big track. There we go. Nah, that's the gas pedal. Oh, nope, we're getting the brakes again. Don't know why. I don't know why we're all the way back here. <laughs> this is... This is goofy. I don't see, like, the six-second gap. I mean, maybe I'm just impatient, I guess. But, yeah. You know, like, the guy in front of me is yelling at the guy that's not going anywhere. In the chat. We kind of start for a second, and then we let off. Kind of rolling now. At least it makes the uh, base lap more interesting, I guess, because we're... <laughs> we're not just... Hanging in that line, we're just kind of starting and stopping. Like we're in traffic. Catch up, 14, Hmm. There we go, we're starting to actually catch up now. There we go, we made it. Took us a while, but we made it. That would have been pretty frustrating if we were trying to pit. And uh, actually try to get out of the pits fast, but... Okay, that's fine here. So over halfway, we've uh, we're gonna eat up another couple laps here before this caution's over. And uh, what I hope to do is catch on to the draft enough to keep up, but uh, far away enough that. I can hit my brakes if something goes terribly, terribly wrong. And thankfully the brakes on these things are pretty good. So there's that. I don't know, warm the tires to get grip in the corners, I guess. We're just bored. One left to green. Ice cars in this lap. Green. Still kind of uh, super far apart from each other. I know that's kind of like a, uh, a stereotype for IndyCar drivers, like uh, on iRacing. A lot of people are like, you know, IndyCar drivers don't know how to pace. I guess maybe this is why, because they just don't bunch up. Stop and go thing going on. Interesting. Sure does feel extra slow though when we're going 250 and then all of a sudden we're going 70. When you juxtapose those two speeds, suddenly the 70 feels very, very slow. Let me all warm my tires. Look at this. This tire's gonna be so warm. Mmm. I'm gonna make it through that corner so, so good. 
It's gonna grip so good. <laughs> okay. Well, we're uh, a mile back again. It looks like a uh, couple of guys in front of us are some of the worst offenders, and then get another super far back. About to go green. Stay focused. I mean, I get the idea, wanting to avoid the crashes, but. I mean, you gotta be prepared if this thing does go green. I'm like, oh my god, look how far back we are. Come on. Green flag, green flag. Jeez, man. If you're gonna hang back, at least move to the left side so people that do want to go can go. I don't get it. Car inside. Still there at the bottom. Clear. There's going. Outside. Keep low. Are we still on the draft keep enough low. to keep up? Outside, clear. Would like to know this information. Man, look at that all-time best lap. Well, we got fuel in it, so why is it so good again? I don't know how these things work. Okay, what well, that guy's going on the inside? Just can't uh, can't draft in a line for a minute. You just gotta take it three wide. We're just kind of trying to keep up with the pack, right? But he feels cool though. He made a pass. He's up a position, carving through the field. As I'm half throttle. <laughs> Since side by side's not gonna help us keep up. I think we could probably catch right back up to him though if we uh, needed to flat foot it now. I think the uh draft is not quite as big of a deal uh, in terms of keeping up in these. Oh man, I see people on the apron. We might be in the right spot. Just keeping an eye up there. I hope uh, good old 14 behind us doesn't run into us if we have to break. No 7th gear. Thought I'd check. 250 is just not fast enough, you know. That's not how you take the corner. How is this car alive? Now he's gonna block me. Okay. Sick moves, bro. We're up to the pack now. I'm not, not so interested in getting any closer than this. It's the no petting zoo. Don't get too close, they'll bite you. Fourteen, you wanna go around me? Get three wide up there. Sure you wanna be close to it? Getting into each other. Inside. Clear inside. I mean, do you see what I'm seeing? i s I'm seeing something pretty scary. I will say, there are no green white checkers in this series, so you have to kinda of start going a little sooner. When do we go for it? Might have to be soon. Looks like we can reach that pack without too much issue. If we get to that point and I have to start racing up there, uh, I'm telling you, that's going to be pretty thrilling, I think. Hang back a little longer, though. Maybe wait till uh, 10 to go or something. Why is this guy so close? Clear. Big track. There's a guy in the wall. Looks like you can survive with, like a tiny little wall taps. 
to an extent. It's good to know. So I've seen a couple guys kind of... I think if you hit it square, it's a little nicer. Do your uh, car and doesn't kill you quite as much. Hmm. Come back. Alright, oh, what are you doing? Okay, bye. <laughs> Not hanging back fast enough for him. Driving right in the middle of the track, that's kind of obnoxious. What do we got, Rick? Why are we checking out? Outside is clear. Car inside, yep. clear inside. They're not liking what they're seeing. I must have missed something interesting. But, uh, I'm trying to make a video here, so why don't we do something fun, huh? The funnest things are deadly, right? Still there at bottom. Oh god. Clear inside. Here we go. We're in it. Car inside. Well, we got the throttle there as they checked out. Still there. Yeah. Ooh, that guy's switching lanes. Clear inside. Hmm. Run. I don't want to take it three wide still. Not quite yet. So what happened there? Keep high. Clear. Inside. Kind of like my positioning though. I feel like if I uh, go up there, I can. And grab that draft enough to really slingshot myself up. I'd give myself some room to start building that run. You're in the top dead position. Up, was up, up on five to go. What do you think the safest part of the track is? Probably the bottom? Just fly up and hit the top of the you know, go up the track and hit the outside wall? Maybe. Time it right. Where's he going? Looks like guys are kind of starting to go. Stay low. Hmm. Stay low. There is a car more cars means more cars that can run into each other. I'm gonna hang back. They seem to be touching. Uh, I was gonna go. I kind of went up there and then I was like, eh. Let's see. I hate an apron, that's not good. I think uh, we gotta go. Car outside. Go where? Because we're three wide. Inside. Clear. Inside. I wanted to get the run, but... Still there. Hold your line. Keep high. Still there. Clear. Car inside. You're up top. Three wide. Alright, go red car, go! I believe! I believe we're gonna die! Oh! 
Let's go, let's go, Red, let's go! Oh, uh, he doesn't have the speed. He doesn't have the run, he doesn't have the momentum. You're in the top ten. Guy high. Running this high line. You're up the top three wide. There they go. There. I got hit. I got hit. I got a 4x. I don't know what it was. <laughs> Still hold. Right side. Two wide. Still there. Hold your line. I don't know about this. Red's in the wall. I don't think I want to follow this guy anymore. I uh, don't have much of a choice, though. There's just no room. There's not enough room to make these moves I want to make. Down here, then. Hang back and try to get a good run up. We'll try to find space, but I don't know if it's going to happen. I just don't know. There's no room. You can't really do anything. That's kind of disappointing. What am I supposed to do here? You can get the run, but there's no room on the track. Hmm. Still there, hold your own. going for it. He kind of found something in the middle. Nope. Go low. We're live for now. Clear up top. Okay. Sure. Uh oh. Okay, we're done. Chicken flag. Chicken flag. Stop the car. What is all this? What are these 4Xs adding after the race is over? What is that? I didn't hit anyone. What was all that? You saw that. What on earth? Okay, whatever. We get 8X this race and we never touch anyone. But uh, we got 7th. Alright. That was not as fun as I thought it would be. I thought we would at least be able to like do something with the big runs that we could get. But, you know, they're just blocking the whole track so you can't really do anything. It's a little less interesting that road because I mean, look, I mean, they're just blocked. It's a block. And uh, that guy gets into that. And that guy just. I don't know what happened to that guy. Oh, they hit, they hit the tires. Okay. I mean, that was that. That was kind of anticlimactic. <laughs> but. Okay, and then whatever that was. Guy's wrecking after it's over. Look this black car it just comes up and kills him for no reason, and then we get incident points for it. I saw it and we came down here, and they're like, "Oh, I guess because I did that." Now all of a sudden, I get all these incident points piled up. I don't know. Whatever. It's not gonna matter too much. But okay, <laughs> we didn't wreck and die. Uh, we got seventh. Okay, sure. Top 10. Um, I didn't know why I signed up. Uh, I still don't know why I signed up. But at least we uh, got a respectable finish, sure. Still don't understand that. But, okay. I thought it was going to be much worse. I thought we were going to have horrible major wrecks multiple times through the race. And we only kind of just had the couple car wrecks. Uh, and we'll go look at them now, I suppose. So, what do we have happening out here? Let's get in the wall, maybe. Get one in the pits on lap one. What about that one? Maybe you got a penalty, maybe you passed before the, uh, before the green flag. Red cars in the wall. Get in the wall. Maybe I'm just not good, and that's why I couldn't see the opportunities ahead of me, but, I mean, it really was just, like, looking at a, a wall in front of me, and, like, there's nowhere you can go. I was thinking, like, okay, well, 
you can like go to the high side and take the high side and you know take it three wide when it's near the end but they're kind of like just already three wide maybe I had to go sooner maybe that's what my problem was but I don't know oh, there's some of that prediction code I was saying was gonna happen you guys don't touch but you're going so fast and it's trying to predict where you're going uh, this movement that the car on the bottom does like that game thinks he's gonna keep continue moving up so uh, it pretends that it does happen as we uh, sneak our way through I think that one wasn't a caution if I remember correctly I think it might have eventually become become a caution depending on how it all shaped out but Oh, that was the caution. Okay, so the guy spins on purpose so he can get the caution. Okay, that's cool, man. That's cool of ya. Oh no, I got on the gas too hard. That's a normal mistake for the number three car to make. Caution's not even out yet. Now he just looked like a doof. Oh, I bet, I bet he doesn't do it again. I bet he's learned. Right? This teammate gonna do it next? What's what it end up being the did we get a caution yet? No. Oh, is this his teammate? Oh no! Someone else did it by accident. Oh, what a shame. Is it still not caution? Is it caution now? Yep, they finally got it. Such a shame that someone accidentally spun out. And totally aren't abusing the system. That guy didn't even fake it as well as the other guy. Because this guy's like not even out of the pits yet. <laughs> How sad. Uh alright, well we get our yellow flag because uh guys uh forgot how to drive, quote unquote. That guy just has a broken wheel, so he has a good excuse. So after the caution, air quotes, um, this guy just, oh, that's what happened, I guess. To the 21, that's unfortunate. Did he get hit, I guess? I thought I, I kind of missed what exactly happened. He just gets run over. This other guy got nose damage, so. Penalized. His behavior. What brought out the actual yellow, though, because that didn't bring out a yellow, but I think we had one, right? Or did we not? Maybe not? Oh. Let's get in the wall. The wall hits. Yeah, see, they're, like, already kind of just, like, blocking the whole track. Making these little taps. There's me just stuck. It's like, what do I do now? Yeah, at one point, I like, tried to take the high side with the, the red car, but it just didn't go anywhere. You can't bump draft or anything like in a stock car. Hmm. Yeah, look at that brick. <laughs> oh, yeah, and there's the wreck. Waited. Though I think it like gave us a 4x or something. Didn't it give us a 4x or something stupid from this? We got a 4x at some point this early in the race that was just nonsensical. But I mean, we didn't, we didn't get hit by anything there. Okay. So I don't know. So that's kind of the line. That's how it finished. And this, where we get even more phantom incident points. So, I had an immaculate car pretty much and get an 8x. Funny. That guy goes tumbling. Oh my god. And uh, we got a bit of a junkyard. And those are the grandstands.
Okay, <laughs> well, that's that. So, okay, sure. Got a mediocre, like, seventh place as the two car. Like, okay, I mean, I survived. Um, don't know why I signed up. Still don't know why. Don't know how to feel about it. <laughs> just, I guess I was just kind of curious how it would be, how it would go. And uh, now I know. So, there's that. All right. Um, hope I satisfied your curiosity as well. Um, that was Indy at Daytona. Thanks for watching.